Travel directions from Rossville to Ringgold. One of the many ironies of the Federal Road lies in the fact that Rossville and Ross's Landing were named for Chief John Ross, the chief who was the Cherokee's most aggressive opponent of migration to the West. The irony is, at Ross's Landing, the original name for Chattanooga, many roads converged into the most centralized location for American Indians to gather, or be forced to gather, to move west on the Trail of Tears. After touring the Chief John Ross House, the traveler should return to Highway 27, heading south, then turn left at Highway 146, which is also called Cloud Springs Road. Cloud Springs Road, or 146, passes a bit south of the route of the old Federal Road, but the route of the original road is hard to find and impossible to travel with so many new roads in development. Take 146 for several miles until it reaches Highway 41 and turn right, heading south and southeast. One drives through Indian Springs and crosses Pea Vine Creek, site of some important Civil War fighting in 1863. Continuing southeast on Highway 41 has more recent connotations as well. The Allman Brothers mentioned it in their 1969 song Ramblin' Man in the memorable lines, My father was a gambler down in Georgia, wound up on the wrong end of a gun. I was born in the back seat of a Greyhound bus, rolling down Highway 41. The traveler should ramble on through Shookville to Ringgold. For the traveler, the Ringgold train depot is an excellent place to stop, both because it is attractive and has parking, and because it was important as a Civil War site. The Western Atlantic Railroad, created in 1836 by an act of the Georgia legislature, transported both Confederate and Union soldiers before parts of it were burned. The depot was built in 1849 with local sandstone blocks. After it was damaged during the Battle of Ringgold Gap in November 1863, repairs added the other colors in the building's materials. The town of Ringgold has a number of opportunities for eating, shopping, and hotels. A small park just east of Ringgold allows one a view of the Ringgold Gap, a crucial area of travel for Civil War soldiers. When you reach the Ringgold Depot or downtown area, please stop. While you drive toward Ringgold, I will tell the story of Chief John Ross, Ross's Landing, and the Trail of Tears.